VO 3.1 is here. So, VO 3 just came out, then Sora 2, and now VO 3.1 is already here. And today, we're going to cover a bunch of different examples, comparing it to Sora 2, as well as comparing it to VO 3, across a bunch of different stuff, kind of real-life stuff. Here's a thumbnail I'm going to use, generating stuff just from a single image. So, we're going to try a bunch of stuff, including, actually, a funny one, is a song as well. Um, I'll give you a little sneak peek. We're the Greg's lorry coming your way. That's actually really quite good. But anyway, so VO 3.1, next leap and video gen. So when it comes out fully, because right now this is just the early access that I have, but when it fully comes out, the duration is going to be over 30 seconds, which is one of the kind of flagship features of it, um, and 1080p. And to do it right now, all we have to do is give it an image, give it a prompt, and then click Generate, and boom, that's you done. So I'll show you how to actually do this in Higgsfield, which is the platform we're using today. Higgsfield, honestly, is amazing. You can see you can get all your different video generators in here, but also a bunch of image generators as well. So one place for all of your stuff, and it's really cost efficient as well. So anyway, also, quick side note, you get different trends, which is cool too. So if we go to presets, we can see you can actually no. choose whoa, a bunch of different presets for stuff, including for different social medias, which is pretty cool. Anyway, so if we come back to our VO3, the way to use it is we select a preset here. So you can general selfie, sell and stuff. You can get different like podcast ones and stuff, which is pretty cool. I'm just going for general. Then you give it an image. You let the prompt um, speak for itself. <laughs> and then the model here. So for the model, you can see you can pick from a bunch. We're going to go view 3.1, quality, 720 or 1080p. And then aspect ratio is one of these. So either just standard long form or short form content, essentially. Now, you'll see here there is no time duration, and that's because it's the early access. As you can see, like if we go to Sora 2, they have a duration. Well, for 3.1 early access, it's automatically 8 seconds, but as you've seen in that uh, preview a minute ago, it's going to be over 30 seconds, like up to a minute. And there's a bunch of people talking about it online, about how it's going to be like up to a minute, etc. It's going to be like cutting edge, best thing ever. Well, let's check it out. So, first example that I want to show you here is this one here, where view 3, it's super accurate, but... Um, Look at what it does to me, man. <sighs> it's giving me, it's giving me bald hair and moobs. <laughs> That's shocking. Look at this. Who's this me? Oh, but watch it. So I just give it this screenshot. <sighs> and it looks so legit. Not legitly me, but does look legit. Desk looks a bit funky here. I don't know what all this malarkey is, but um, pretty cool, pretty good guesstimation. Um, another one as well that I want to cover here is uh, I get a digger digging up uh, stuff here, which is pretty cool. And the way I got this image, which is notable to mention, is actually from Higgsfield. So what you can do is here, upload an image or generate it. If you click on generate it, it goes to here, and here's a bunch of different images that I've generated, including just ones of people, and then of diggers. This is for my son, he loves diggers. Um, and then bodybuilders, which I thought it actually done such a good job at um, being able to yeah, create the, like, the musculature and stuff. Anyway, so you can create that, and then you can use that for here, which is uh, what I had actually done for the bodybuilder one. So... For the bodybuilder, I wanted to see, can it hold this level of detail across various movement patterns? So for this one, I ask it to do a front double bicep, bam, um, and then a backflip. It's also Mr. Olympia season, so good time for that. And as you can see here, front double bicep. Front double bicep looks good, but then this is the backflip. No backflip. So, I've gotten them to try again, this time just do the backflip. And wait, you see this. I don't know what's going I don't know what's going on there, but that, my friend, is not a backflip. So, I mean, 
a little disappointed in the VO3.1 um, mechanics here, but I'm testing it to the limits because, I mean, the amount of physics detail that it has to maintain here. Where's this guy? What's, what's on his ankle? Does it stay on his ankle the entire time? Yeah, kind, mm, kind of. I, mm, I don't know what he's up to. Um, but I, one that was cool, because that's a bit of a dodgy one, one that was really quite cool just before we check it out against Sora, was this one here. So I just put a picture of me and say, Get a video of the man eating some wads. And there's something so satisfying about it. Firstly, I like that the audio kind of actually works. Because before when I tried like VO3, the audio was just like random. It, was, it didn't really meet what was happening in time, whereas this kind of does. It's just so satisfying, but also see the ability to like get my head here in the beard and stuff. Everything other than my nose is legit. My nose is just slightly more inwards, but how is it too? Yeah, I thought that one was really quite good. Um, but you do need to be aware because it makes you just say gobbledygook sometimes too. Because here, for example, is uh, Joanna, my partner. Listen to this. Don't to me from Blaze. We're actually not late to Reddy's. I mean, we're actually going to have to the intent. And Tipper picks that one of Reddit. Sounds at the end like it says Topix at Reddit <laughs> or something. But um, the way that the t shirt falls, if I mute it, the way the t shirt falls, the movement, the slow blink and stuff, um, they all look like legit, like an actual person, which is pretty cool. But I don't know what, what they're saying. It's just gobble what we got. From Blaze. Actually, not late to Reddy's. I mean, what to the gun shop to the intent? And um, Tipper picks that one of Reddit. Toe picks at Reddit, something like that. But also, it can make music. So, this here is a Greg's sausage roll lorry. Now, I generated this on ChatGPT, I don't know, a couple of months ago, because again, my son loves lorries and diggers and stuff. And uh, I got it to make a song, and it is actually really quite good. We're the Greg's Lorry coming your way, bringing tasty treats to brighten your day. Now, if you can make these 30 to 60 seconds long, this could be amazing. Um, but yeah, I thought that was actually really quite impressive. But then a couple of other dodgy ones, like this one here, and then we'll check. Or actually, you know what? Yeah, we'll check that and then we'll go VO3 and Sora. So, we have here... Let's rock! Her clothes just kind of disappear. I said rip their clothes off and they're wearing a rock and roll outfit. I just imagine like a leotard thing and they go BAM! To see if it could like rip them off with that Benson Boom style. But um, the clothes just kind of seem to fall off. It feels kind of Aussie-esque. It's like the AI Aussie stuff you'd see. Anyway, so let's check it out against VO3 and then we'll go Soda too. So, the man eating the words thumbnail was pretty good last time. So I thought I'd try it again with another thumbnail. But this time, I don't know if it's because it's n not like real realistic, it's like cartoony, but it's a bit dodgy. <laughs> but it's, uh, it's better than VO3, because check this. This is the AI Agent Browser. So as you can see, big leap forwards since VO3 um, and every every aspect. But let's compare it then to Sora 2. So in my Sora video, I da, 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 generated some of these. Let me see. Yeah, I made a bunch and it wasn't working at first. But here we go. So I made a bunch of these um, Pigeon and McDonald's crazy ones and thumbnail not thumbnail, YouTube subscriber play button ones. So if we check this here, I just gave it a prompt, man pictured getting a 1 million subscriber plaque from a robot, and here is the result from Sora 2. No way, this is the million? Affirmative, 1 million subscribers achievement insane. unlocked. This is beautiful, thank you. Congratulations, Jalen, you earned it. Which, when I first watched it, and I've watched it then like 10 times, I thought, this is amazing. But then, look at this, watch. So he pushes the robot's hand away, his hand comes back and boom, two hands appear. Two AI hands. 
I thought we were fixed here, but no. And then it, it merges at the end into into one hand. Boom. Um, so I took the screenshot from the beginning and decided to test VO 3.1. Let's see what it made. So, so no voices, just celebration stuff. I accidentally done it in the wrong aspect ratio. So I think what happened is it cut this as the first frame and used it from here because the guy looks completely different. Different. He's got a t-shirt, not a hoodie, etc. Um, but he does have the right, right number of hands. They don't appear to change. It's just the two hands. How many fingers? One, two, three, four, five. Five and five. He looks like a, a real guy. Pretty cool. So, um, but not really comparable. And so that's how we have this one here with this bald guy with specs on, uh, arguing with some, some McDonald's flying workers. So if I scroll down here, we have created this first one. Again, with Sora 2, I just said, just make the video from scratch and then it just generates it. I don't have to give it an image. Um, I don't know if we will have to give it an image when we actually get the full 3.1 release. Anyway, so Sora 2, here we go. What in the world? They're wearing uniforms. And they stole my... I thought that was actually really quite good. Versus if we do 3.1, this is what we have. I didn't order this. Why are you wearing uniforms? Your order is correct, sir. Step aside if you are not ordering. The fact it's got a brush for the bald guy seems a bit shocking. I didn't order this. Why are you wearing uniforms? But it seems a bit more sensationalist. It seems better in a way, but also less realistic. Your order is correct, sir. Step aside if you are not ordering. Um, and that's the best version, because again, I accidentally did it in the wrong aspect ratio first, and watch the chips or the fries just disappear. <gasps> but I mean, the detail and stuff in the face and the expression, I'm really quite impressed at. So I mean, Overall, I think 3.1, it's not leaps and bounds ahead, but it definitely looks to be getting better. Um, and I was having a talk with someone today, I don't know how I feel about all this AI stuff with them, you know, getting better, because it does, this does feel a bit dystopian, I must admit. But anyway, let me know what you think in the comments below, and go and check out Higgsfield. AI to go and use the latest in video and image. Right now it's 3.1, VO 3.1, but whatever the latest one is when you're watching this video, Higgsfield will have it first. So go check them out. It'll be the first link in the description below. See you later. Bye.